Mila była partnerka Wade'a Wilsona, mężczyzny, który został skazany za brutalne zamordowanie dwóch kobiet w Cape Coral w październiku 2019 roku. Ofiarami były Christine Melton i Diane Ruiz. Mężczyzna udusił obie kobiety w odstępie kilku godzin. Pomiędzy morderstwami spotkał się ze swoją partnerką Milą, aby powiedzieć jej o tym, co zrobił. Jednak również ją próbował zaatakować. Przysięgli zarekomendowali karę śmierci dla Wilsona. Mężczyzna oczekuje wyroku 27 sierpnia. W internecie pojawiło się dużo kontrowersji na temat tego, czy faktycznie jest winny. Wiele internautów jest zauroczonych Wade'em i podpisują petycję, aby ocalić go od kary śmierci. Jeżeli nie znacie w przypadku Wade'a Wilsona odsyłam Was do moich filmów na ten temat. A dzisiaj posłuchamy sobie rozmowy telefonicznej, która miała miejsce tuż po jego areszcie w 2019 pomiędzy Wilsonem a Milą. Para wspólnie prowadziła biznes spa, który według Wilsona tak naprawdę był biznesem escort. Po morderstwie Christine Wilson przyjechał do spa, aby porozmawiać z Milą. Podobno chciał jej powiedzieć, co się stało. Jednak kobieta zaznała, że Wade ją zaatakował. Próbował wciągnąć do auta, zaczął bić. Opowiedziała w bardzo graficznym sposób, co miało miejsce tego okropnego dnia. Jednak niedawno w internecie pojawiły się nagrania rozmów telefonicznych tuż po areszcie. Mila wydaje się nadal darzyć uczuciami Wilsona. On zresztą tak samo. Więc dzisiaj zapraszam Was do posłuchania tych rozmów i do dyskusji na sam koniec. Wiele osób zmienia zdanie, czy Mila może nie wrobiła Wade'a Wilsona, bo wydaje się, że wcale się go tutaj nie boi, a wręcz przeciwnie, chciałaby z nim widzieć jakąś przyszłość. Wade! Hey, what's up? What the f*** is wrong with you, dude? I can't believe you picked up the phone, dude. I can't believe I picked up the phone either. Hey, baby. You can, baby, can you just call me baby, though? You don't have to call me dude and stuff. Yes, It's, baby. I love yes, you. I love you, baby. How are you? Why? Why? I know. Why? I know. Why? I just, wrote you, I just wrote you a message. Remember that kiosk that we used to write each other on? Yeah. I wrote you a message on there just now. <laughs> I know. How, how do Because I do I'm still your friend on that kiosk. Remember where you sent me pictures and stuff on that machine? Well, okay, well, the cop sees my phone in my car, so you have to tell me a new, the address to get it. Okay. Oh, on the thing? I don't know. How did, yeah. you used to, how did you used to get it where I used to write you on that machine? I don't remember, but the cops on my phone had to get a new phone and everything. You had to get a new phone, baby? I'm so sorry, they, they baby. They my phone and my car. Yeah. Baby, I want to tell you something. I'm never... I'm, um, Well, obviously, you know, I'm never coming home again. I know that. You know, <laughs> and so, so it's what, really bad. What the fuck? Why do you do this to me? We had everything going for us. <laughs> I'm sorry, baby. We yeah. had everything going for us. I know, baby. I know we did. <laughs> you were out. You were in the clear. And I was good. I was good. No, Amila, you know why I did that? Because I was trying to tell you what was going on, and you were fucking so putting on a like show, dude. Or what? Tried to what, Mila? Attack me? No, baby. I was not trying to attack you, but you were like, that girl was there, you were causing a scene. I didn't want to I do that. I was causing a scene because I didn't want to get in the car with you because you were scaring me. Well, no, but I was trying to tell you what was going on, you know? I was trying to, mm -hmm. I was trying to. Baby, I was trying to tell you that's all I was trying to do. I wasn't trying to hurt you. Why did this happen? Huh? What, baby? Why? What is going on? How did this happen? How did this happen? I don't know, dude. How? Did you do this? How? Like, tell me. I want answers. You want answers? Well, remember when I went to that dude's house or whatever? Wait, no. Okay, listen. You went to somebody's house? Okay, listen. Yeah. My house was driving away. Was that girl in the car? They were both in the car. Something. Who? Two girls? Yeah. You had two girls in my car and driving away. And who was driving? The dude. Remember the dude that we were in the barn with? That was they, sitting there. It was, uh, my back seat was full of stuff, you know? Well, what is it? How did you put four people in the car? Well, listen. Yeah. Baby, listen. Listen to listen what I'm saying. Remember the dude that was sitting at the table that bought us the shots? Remember? Yes. Okay. I went to his house. Yes, with the two girls. Yes. What happened? Please say something. You can talk and code or whatever. Just say something. 
Wait, what? What, baby? You can talk in code or whatever you have to. Just see no, baby, I already, they already know. I don't have to talk in code. Well, then tell me what happened then. I, I fucking killed the bitch. Why, Wade, why? Because we went to this dude's house, Mila, and remember when he kept showing us the pictures? Oh, I got this, I got this, I got this, or whatever. Yes. So I went to his house, and I did a lot of it. Like, he was giving me a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot. And I was doing a lot of... Huh? Why did you kill that girl? I shouldn't have. I'm wrong. Tell me, tell me what happened. Did you have sex with her? You went and killed her? What? No, I didn't have sex with her. I went, I killed her though. Why? Why, Wade? Because I was fucking freaking out on those drugs. Whatever he gave me must have been like fucking like bath salts or something else. It wasn't cocaine. What did, what happened to where you grab a knife and stab her? What happened? I didn't stab her. Who said I stabbed her? People keep saying you stabbed the girl. How'd you kill it? No. I choked her out. I choked her out until she died. Until she was dead. You yeah. that you were going to do that to me one day. Mila, I was never going to do that to you, babe. Mila, I didn't even want to fucking... Mila, when I came back to see you, the only reason I was freaking out like that wasn't because I was trying to scare you. It was because I had it to tell you... I know, I, Mila, I know I did, but the... I know, Mila. Mila, I'm sorry. You know I love you, baby. I'm sorry for doing that to you. I was wrong. I was wrong. I was wrong. I was wrong. But I didn't... But I'm never going to see you again now. You can... Be... Everything can go in for you. Baby, will you please see me again? This is going to ruin my life if you never see me again, please. Your life is ruined, babe. What do you not understand? You can't... Yeah, but if I have you in my... If I, at least if I have you in my life, I won't feel like it's over, you know? I, I, Mila, I understand. Like, you... I, Mila... I don't want to be alone without you. I love you. I really love you, baby. I'm sorry. You kill people, motherfucker. <laughs> okay, motherfucker. I know. I know that. Motherfucker. <laughs> huh? Why did you choke her out? Why? Tell me. Mila, because... Listen, wait. I don't want to talk about this. Well, you don't have to, but you have to explain something to me. What is it? And the other girl. The other girl. Why? Why? She was walking to work, motherfucker. Yeah, no. I know, Why? Why couldn't you rob her? Why did you have to kill her? <sighs> because I was freaking out on the drugs. I was on the drugs. The drugs had me fucking. So ma'am. Mila, please don't do this to us right now. Please. Listen, I know. And listen to me. Listen to me. I'm fine. I know you're going to fucking find another man that's free, obviously. I know that. I, I just. Can't date you. you. You killed two women and you tried to murder me. I think you would have killed me too. Baby, that's a fucking lie. You better fucking never believe that, ever. You no, I wouldn't. I'm right on the balcony. I'm going to stab you right now. I'm going to kill you. I'm going to. I didn't say I was going to stab you, Neela. Yeah. No, you you can't say I'm going to kill you right now. Right before. Oh. You, right before you come to me. Said, I'm kill you. Baby, it's because I was trying to scare you to fucking shut up so you could so I could tell you what I had just done. Baby, baby, listen, baby, listen, listen. Let me tell you something. Me and you were like Bonnie and Clyde. So if I had just gone and done something crazy, I should be able to come back and tell you. I couldn't even tell you because you're causing a scene. Now I'm scared because I know what I've just done. I'm trying to tell you. You won't let me tell you. You and think calling me a bitch or hoe? All this stuff is gonna get me in the I mean, no. Did I call you a hoe? When did I call you a hoe? Mila, you better stop. I didn't never call you. Never called you a hoe. You know I did. You, you freaked out on me, and you know it. Okay, I'm sorry, but I didn't call you a hoe, and you know it. I didn't That's what you were about. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 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 yeah. Hey, listen. I had some. I had. Listen. I have. Listen, Mila. You know. You know the kiosk, baby. Listen. What? You, hey, baby. Baby. You know, Maybe. Matt gets really fucking concerned about you. He keeps calling me. Did you tell him what's up? Yes, I told him what you did. He didn't okay. believe it. Yeah. Baby, are you going to have me on that kiosk? I, listen, they put me in, listen, I'm in solitary, like, confinement. I get to come out of the room for, like, 45 minutes a day. So. Wait, you're going to spend the rest of your life in jail. Do you know this? Can I ask you a question, Mila? Yeah. If I don't ask you for canteen, can I talk to you on the phone and stuff? And you're saying you won't ask me for money? If you don't want to, I don't have to. I'd rather just talk to you. I'd rather not lose you. <laughs> I'd, no, I'd rather do anything not to lose you, you motherfucker. <laughs> you're in jail. Wait, <laughs> baby, baby, I didn't want to lose you on this. I didn't want to lose you on the street. It hasn't changed. It's not because I'm in jail. It's because you're you're my girl. 
All you had to do was not kill people, Wade. It's not. Thank you, Mila. What are you doing right now? What are you up to? I'm sitting here drinking Patron. <laughs> are you drinking Patron? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you the fuck out. What are you at the spa? Are you at the spa drinking? I'm at the spa alone by myself, yes. Yeah. Okay, 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 okay. It's Riley with the dog. Oh, wait, Riley? Right, right. Okay. You destroyed everything, Wade. We could have had everything. Mila, I miss the shit out of you, and I love you, and I'm going to love you till the day I die. I'm going to be older, and I'm going to die in prison. And hopefully, Mila, hopefully you can come see me in prison, baby. Because people How in prison... How are you okay people... with this shit, Wade? How are you okay with saying you're going to die in prison? Aren't you sad? Yeah, Mila, you don't understand how sad I am, baby. I'm just trying to fucking... You out. Yeah. You yeah, I know. Probation. We just had to keep it good for two years. A year. Only a year. A year. Why the fuck you do this and wait? I'm so sorry, Mila. Baby, I'm so fucking sorry, Mila. Do you, know what, do you know what's so crazy? Do you want to know how crazy it is? The number one thing I'm sad about is not that I have to spend the rest of my life in prison, even though that is. The number one thing I'm sad about is over you. Is over you, baby. I'm sad. No, I'm more sad. I'm more sad that I fucked up with you than anything else. That's what I'm more sad over. Isn't that crazy? You were so bad. Baby, I'm, I'm more sad about losing you than anything else. That's the worst. That's, and to be yeah, honest, with, no, listen, why? to be honest, with, listen, so to be honest with you, you don't even under, you can't even begin to understand the pain that I fucking feel losing you, Mila. You have no idea how bad it is. It, and it's no, it's really, not wasted. I know. You don't think that I've had something ripped from my life as well? Yeah, I guess so. I guess you have. I was trying to keep you good. Yeah. I could have kept you good. On one night away from me, you do this. I wish, yeah, I wish when I was trying to drive away that you, you tried to stop me and I made you, you not stop me. You would have freaked out on me and killed me instead. No, I wouldn't have killed, <laughs> Casey, I wouldn't have killed you. Why I went to his house. Tell him this room. Tell him I went to ended up for this room. Listen, baby, can you add me on this machine, though? Can we add each other on the yeah, machine? You have to put these, these fucking things. Wait. Okay, give me this. Give me one second, okay? Hold on. Oh, I'm out, but I just want to leave my car. Baby. 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 The news is here. Everything the what? I have to do interviews. I'm not going to do it, though. The I'm news is there right now? Yeah. What, at the front door? Yeah. Yeah. Hey, listen, I just sent you a friend request. It should, did you get a text message or anything on your phone? No, but you have to tell me how to do that. All right, hold on. Maybe can I tell you the website so you can do that? Yeah, right now. All right, it's called smartjailmail.com. Jailmail. Wait. Baby, yeah, listen. Baby. Will you just listen? I'm gonna. It's smartjailmail.com. I'm doing it right now. Smart yeah, smartjailmail. So the news is out there. They want a story from you, right? Babe, like four different news people are coming here, and I'm. I haven't done a story yet because people think I bailed you out of jail. And that's not the truth. People are blaming me. They're blaming you. Yeah. yeah baby, you did. didn't bail me out of jail. I just got out of jail. You didn't bail me out. I know that, but there's records that say that too. Um, so what, they want, to, they want to interview from the girl that's closest to me? Oh, no, Kelly's all over the news. She's a I know, my dad told me, my dad told me. Yeah. She, she's getting she's the shit. So was Tommy, Tommy was on the news too. Tommy yeah, my dad told me Tommy was too. Did you go to Josh's house and say you killed somebody? Did you go to Josh's? Yeah. Why did you do that? Because, Mila, because all, you know what, Mila? I'm going to be honest with you, all because of you. All because you caused the scene, and I couldn't tell you what I had done, and you were outside with your fucking you friend. Kill me too, Wade. Why don't nope. you understand that? Who tried to kill you, Mila? When? Baby. You were gonna come Baby, I was. Yeah. Well, I wasn't gonna kill you, babe. I was trying to fucking tell you what I had done, so me and you could fucking handle something, and you know maybe I could fucking be better. What the hell was I still with you? I heard that you were driving up to places asking for drums of acid and stuff. Is that what you wanted me to do with you all day? No, baby. I didn't drive up to... Who said that? I don't know. Somebody said that you were, like, high as fuck trying to drive around with... You me. have one minute remaining. Baby, can I call you back? You can call me back. Okay, okay. 
and I have to, my dad put like, my dad put $20 on my canteen, so I'm going to fucking, Is that um, how you're calling me? No. Wait, what? Your dad turned you in, you know? Yeah, I know. I know he did. I know. I know he did. I know. He turned me in to live the rest of my life in here. Isn't that great? Wait, you can't go around killing people. Mila, I know that. I'm so sorry. I love you so much. You know I love you, Mila. You know I do, baby. Baby, you know I love you, I'm right? Never gonna see you again, you know that. You know yes, that you can. Right? Don't say that, Bila. Why are you saying that? Why are you telling me that? You're never gonna see me again. How? Uh, how? I'm gonna live my life with a murder, right? Like, how do I do this? So you just wanna stop talking to me? I don't want you to. I, I love you still, but I, I know. How, how do I do this? We get over it and we, we try to work we try to work through it if we can. I can't, I can't live my life with somebody in jail, I'm sorry. Thank you for using GTL. Yeah, okay. Hey, what's up? Who? Yeah, no, that's fine. Hello? Hey. Hi baby. Who are you talking to, baby? No, the news is outside. Oh, again? Trying to talk to you? No, baby, the news has been here. Like, they haven't stopped. This is Are you news. serious? You're all, over you're all over the news. No way, baby. Like, you're the number one story right now. Like, you can't go anywhere without it. And yeah. people are on the news, they have my fucking everything. Yeah. I'm sorry, baby. I didn't, I didn't mean to do this. I apologize. I'm so sorry. Mila, okay. I'm sorry. Need to do this. Hey, Mila, can, I, can you do me a favor, baby, please, maybe? And if what? You, if you, can you put $20 on my canteen, please? I knew you'd ask me for money, motherfucker. I'm sorry. My, well, let me talk, motherfucker. My dad put 20 bucks on there for me, but um, I got to get, like, my hygiene and stuff, and I got to get clothes. Like, you know, when you first get here, I got to get stuff. Like, I don't have, like, clothes, socks. If you can, that'd be great. If not, don't worry about it. This is not going to work. Okay, I won't ask ever again. Consider it done. I won't ask. I promise I will never ask you again. Stop it. Okay? Wait, poor girl, they, they're dead. They're dead because of you. I know. I know that, Mila. I know that. Why did you do this? Why? Why? I need answers. Why? Why? Because cause I was freaking out on drugs, dude. You know how I get. That's not an answer, Wade. That's not an answer. You how is it not an answer? Killing people. Okay. Okay. I know. I know. Now I have to suffer. I'm sorry. I know. You're going to suffer forever in jail. You know that. I'm going to suffer. Trust me, I've already been suffering. They put me in a fucking room, and all I do is stare at the wall all day long, Mila. It's terrible. I mean, That's it's what horrible. they have to do to people that kill people. You're not safe to be around people. Yeah. You've done this to yourself. Yeah, I have. I know that. Mila, listen, what do you mean you can't do this with me, though? Can you can you not say that to me? Like, I can't do this or whatever? Can we? What do you say? You want me to say I'm going to marry you and why you're in jail? Maybe. Doesn't sound bad. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't sound, that doesn't sound bad, actually. <laughs> that sounds kind of, baby, that sounds kind of good. <laughs> no, I know, I know. Mila, I just want, I know, I want you to be happy, but you know that you're the best thing in my life, ever. You know you were the best I thing I ever had. Thing in your life. You have no, nothing else now. You ruined yeah. everything. Hey, listen, I had some girl try to add, I had, listen, I got people trying to add me on this jail mail shit that I don't even know. Because I probably, it's like the fucking Mason shit, like people are obsessed with you now. You're all over the Oh, house. they're going to start sending me mail and shit and adding me and stuff? I don't know. Maybe... Yeah, I don't care about that, Mila. I don't care. It's not. It's not cool. I'm not trying to be fucking cool. You know, yeah. Mila. So the news has been outside of your spa and they haven't left the whole time. Well, they, they Mila spas all over the place because of what happened outside. Yeah, yeah. Oh, because of that. Yeah. Yeah. Did you kill her and then come? Kill, try to kill me and then go try to kill the other girl. And no, I I tried to, to I tried to come I tried to I tried to come see you to tell you what I had done. Yeah, but did you kill the second girl at that point? Um, no, I think I killed her later. You think? Yeah, I'm pretty sure I did. I killed her after oh, I, I told you. What they? Like, you things that people remember when they kill somebody. Um, I killed her after I saw you. Why? Why couldn't you just rob her? Why did you have to kill her? I'm sorry. 
I don't know. Why? I, I kind of want to know why. What was going through your head? Uh, you so I heard that you choked her out. She didn't die. She got up and ran. You ran her over with the car. Is that how it went? Um, that is, yeah, it is. She didn't, she didn't get up and run. She didn't get up and run. That's not true. Um, I choked her out, pushed her out of the car, and then I ran her over with the car. How did you get her in the car? She got in by herself. So she got in the car by herself? Yeah. And you choked her out in the car? Uh-huh. Yeah. Pushed her out of the car, and uh-huh. then you... Ran, ran her over. Her. Yeah, like ten times. Do you not hear yourself? Yes, Mila, I do. I hear myself. Does this sound like something that, that you want to be saying out loud? Can you believe that you've done this? No, I can't. I really can't. I was on drugs, dude. I really can't believe it. You know? I I sh- you. There's a you're, lot of people on drugs that don't go around telling people. You're right. You're right. There is. You're right, Mila. And I'm wrong. Oh, you're right. You're right. Wait, Baby. this is not normal, man. Okay, Mila. I get it. Baby. Mila. Mm. Mila. Mila. What? I'm here. What? Don't what me. I'm here too. Don't what me, baby. Okay? I don't know what to say to you. This is just, I could feel like I'm in a, like a nightmare movie or some shit. <sighs> How do you think I feel? Even worse. Trust me. I'm in the nightmare part. You're, at least you're still fucking, you're halfway in, but I you're didn't halfway in. You not do anything, up. wait. You're the one responsible. I didn't do anything. I understand that. I know you didn't do anything. I never said, who said you did anything? I didn't say that. Uh, you're saying, how do you think I feel? I've done nothing wrong. You are responsible for this. I know. You. I know, baby. We had everything. We had everything. Why did you have to go and do this? I didn't have to. I shouldn't have. I fucking should not have. Why did you kill the first girl? I want to know why. What were you, why did you kill her? I want to know why. Because I wanted to. Why did you want to kill her? I just wanted to. More than I want to. Why Honestly, can I tell you? Can I tell you what happened? That dude that gave me the drugs. Do you know what he gave? Do you know what he gave me? What? Meth. Okay. Well, we we know you don't do good on meth, but why? Okay. You, what made you kill that girl? I was angry. I got on meth and I got really fucking crazy. You why know you that. Angry with her? I don't know. I I don't think I was angry with her. I think I just took it out on her. You keep saying that you were like in a relationship with her. Did you know this girl before? Bailey, I'm in a relationship with what the fuck, Mila? I, you can't listen to the stories they're talking about. They're gonna say they're gonna tell you tons of stories about me, and it doesn't mean they're true. Um, no, Mila, I had never met her ever. You just met her at the Buddha. Baby, I don't know who she was. Who, who she was? I didn't even know her I name. Just wasn't I didn't her. I didn't stab her. Why did you think you stabbed her? I heard that too. Somebody, my dad. I think somebody told me that too. They asked me if I had stabbed her or whatever. Well, Josh said that you had blood all over you, and you oh, on my hands and stuff like that. I don't know. He just said you had blood all over you. Why? No, you? I didn't have blood all over me. And that was when you got out to attack me. She said you had more wounds all over you. Was she putting up a fight or what? No, she didn't put up a fight. No. She just I had I had wounds on my hands because I had jumped over some fences. And um, there was like cuts in my hands from the fence. So, um, so and do you remember the cut that I had on my hands from working out on the asphalt? Remember? Yeah. Um, well, those cuts were like they were exposed and they got reopened, so they were like ble- those were bleeding too. Why so, did you choke this girl out? I need answers. I don't understand. Okay, I wanted. To, okay, I choked her out because That's I was on. Funny. I was on this, and she like it made me fucking you mad. Wasn't there a dude with her? She was with a guy, right? Where was the guy when you're choking her out? He left. And you were just there with her and you just decided to kill her? Yep. I did. That would have been had I been there. No, it wouldn't have, dude. Mila, you gotta stop saying that. I love you. I would never have fucking done that to you ever. I never even would have thought about it. And I didn't. And I didn't even, first of all, when I came to see you at the spot, I didn't even want to jump on top of you. I was just so freaked you out about. Can't- I was so I was so freaked out I was so freaked out about what I had just done. You that I, off. You trying to force me into your car. Do you not remember any of this? I remember. I remember. I remember. I remember. I remember. I remember. Mila, I, Mila, I had just killed somebody. I was trying to tell you that, and you weren't allowing me to. You know, so that was kind of like. What did you want me to do? I'm not going to help you hide a fucking body, dude. I didn't. I know that, dude. I know that, Mila. I just wanted to be able to tell you. That was it. I just wanted to tell you. 
and you wouldn't let me. You wouldn't let me tell you or nothing, you know? That's and all I was trying to do. Mother, you're driving around in her car, using her phone. Yeah, I know. I know that. I know Mila. I lost it. I was on drugs, and I lost it, and I did stupid things. And you can still love me, baby. Yes, you can, if you want to. Don't tell me. Unless you just want to stop loving me because of what I did. You're a then psychopath. You, but you, then you never loved me to begin with if you stop loving me. I didn't know you were a killer. I didn't know you could kill somebody. You knew I was a killer. Stop it. I did not know you were a killer. You, so I, you thought all the story. you thought when I told you I'm a killer, I was lying? Yeah, I did, actually. <laughs> well, I wasn't lying. You can't do this shit, man. Okay, Neil, I'm sorry. I'll get better. But listen, I have a long, I'm going to have a long time in prison. At least maybe you could come see me sometimes in prison. I can see you face to face. It's not on video screen. I can touch you. I can see you. I can hug you, kiss you, maybe, if you let me. Stuff like that. Maybe. I don't even think we're supposed to be talking right now, Wade. I don't think so. I don't think so, Dave. You I know you do. I'm not worried about that. I know. Are you going to add me on that thing, on the machine? I'll add you. I'll see what you have to do. Well, did you go to the website? Go to the website right now and see if you can do it. Let's get this done. Mila, you don't have to stop talking to me. I know you love me, baby. I know you do. Even even after I did this, will you not stop? Can we still talk? Please? Just, I feel like I'm just in a forest like right now. I don't know what to do. What's the address then? Um, smartjailmail.com. Smartjailmail.com. I actually still have it on my phone. Hold on. It's you do, right? Phone. It's coming up. Do you remember what my login was? No, baby. That's it. They should have it. Forget your login or forget password or something. I don't even know my username. Well, just... Fuck, man. Okay. Hold on. I'm trying. Okay, baby. No problem. Baby, will you still love me, though, please? I actually just do that. Exactly. You can't just stop loving people, but... That's what I'm saying. How can you... Especially especially when you were the greatest thing in my life, how could I just stop? I can't just stop loving you. This is absolutely the worst thing ever. I can't believe this. I know. Actually, I've got you right here. It says, sorry, baby, you were right. I didn't... Uh, 729, 729. That's... Yeah, that's before. No, that's from before, okay. So, we're, so you're still on there, then? You're still on there. But it says... This Did you log in? ...and requires the payment of 50 service credits to view. I don't know how to do that. All right, I'll have to figure this out later. you got to put credits I and stuff on there. I've got to figure out how to do it, okay? Okay. Will you figure out how to do it today and send, will you send me credits? <laughs> Baby, send, will you send me credits today so when I come out tomorrow I can message you? Listen, you're going to be electrocuted or some shit. Oh, I think they're going to give me the needle. Do you think so? Yeah, I want them to. I want them to. You want to die that way, lethal injection? Yeah. Yeah. You're crazy. Baby, why would I want to live the rest of my life in prison, especially if I'm not going to have you? We just talked about this right before you went back. Why would I want to live the rest of my life in prison if I don't have you, Mila? You're my everything. You know that. What? Say that again? You know I'm not going to wait for you. This is ridiculous. You're not going to wait for me? Why would I? Because I fucking love you so fucking much, Mila. Why would you not? Do you not see what you're putting me through? Yes, baby, I'm sorry. I do see. Why would you not wait on me, Mila? Baby. Forever? You want me to, like, die waiting for you while you're in jail? No. 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 I'm afraid of you. Like, what if you snap and kill me one day? How am I going to kill you? I'm going to be in jail. Well, not now. <laughs> okay, so... This is, this is really hard for me to handle. It's all just feels so weird. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, baby. I'm so, so sorry. Yeah, I know it feels weird, Mila. I'm so, so sorry, baby. I'm sorry, baby, okay? You have every, we had everything going for us. Everything. The best. Everything was so great. Again. You were just uh, out five days. We were, I was only out for five days? Yeah. Yeah. Well, that didn't last long at all. I just wish, I don't know, things were different. I know. Me too. Well, there's nothing that can be done now, so... Well, can I tell you something? My dad is going to try to get me... He's going to get me a lawyer, he said. And, um... Why? And he's the one that you in. I know. I know he is. I know he is. But maybe if I get a lawyer, they can send me to... You were just asking your dad, and he was so happy. 
Huh? He was so happy. He said, it's not that hard way to be. You have one minute remaining. Who so, said that? Conversation, your father on the phone. Oh, with, with my dad? dad? Yeah. It's not that hard to be good, and it's worth it. And it's worth it. You have to go and do all this. Baby, I'm sorry. I'm so, so sorry. I don't know, because I'm stupid, apparently. I'm stupid. Mila, you don't have to... I don't know. Never mind. Never mind. I hope I don't lose you, Mila. I mean it. I really hope I don't lose you. You're the best thing in my life ever. Even even before this, even after this, you're still the best thing ever. You know that. Mila? Baby? Thank you for using GTL. Jestem ciekawa, jakie uczucia wzbudziła w Was ta konwersacja. Para po prostu śmieje się z tego, co zrobił Wade. Wiem, że wiele osób może powiedzieć, że tego typu śmiech to jest strach, czy po prostu poczucie takie niezręczne, jeżeli na przykład chodzi o stronę Mili. Para ewidentnie nadal do siebie coś czuje, a Wilson prawdopodobnie wykorzystuje kobietę, aby po prostu wysyłała mu pieniądze. Zresztą sam on o tym mówi. Przeskakując z tematu morderstwa na temat pieniędzy, mówi, że w sumie nie potrzebuje, nie będzie prosił, bo ważniejsza jest dla niego kobieta. Widziałam, że wiele internautów mówi, że możemy tu usłyszeć bardzo dużo manipulacji z obydwu stron. Ze strony Wade'a, jeżeli chodzi właśnie o pieniądze i wykorzystanie finansowe kobiety, a ze strony Mili takie, że wiele osób wierzy, iż kobieta próbowała wyciągnąć od niego bezpośrednie przyznanie się do winy. Cały czas pyta o to samo, on troszkę kręci dookoła, mówi, że to zrobił, ale nie mówi też do końca dokładnie co, ona cały czas pyta o to samo. Więc naprawdę Prawda wywołało to, no, niemałą burzę w internecie. Tym bardziej, że przypominam, oczekujemy wyroku, który ma się pojawić 27 sierpnia. Dajcie mi znać koniecznie, co myślicie na temat tej rozmowy, jeżeli wysłuchaliście całej. Dla mnie jest to bardzo interesujące posłuchać czegoś takiego, tym bardziej, że są też inne rozmowy, rozmowy z jego ojcem, z kobietą, która nigdy go nie poznała, a po prostu jest nim zauroczona. No i ewidentnie widać, że Wilson dobrze wie, co robi. No i czekamy też na to, czy faktycznie zmaga się z problemami psychicznymi. Dziękuję za obejrzenie kolejnego materiału na moim kanale, zapraszam do subskrybowania i do usłyszenia, zobaczenia w kolejnym.